This is a story about Cindy and the most exciting day in her life. Now her favorite beat group were called the Dolly Beats. She had all their records and pinned their pictures up all over her bedroom wall. Especially pictures of Cliff Warwick, the lead guitar player. So you can imagine how thrilled Cindy was when she heard that the Dolly Beats were going to play a concert in her town. They were selling tickets on the morning of the day of the concert and Cindy planned to be at the theater very early in the morning. But she slept so soundly that she woke up very late instead. Oh my, said Cindy, I'll just die if I don't see the Dolly Beats. And as quickly as she could, Cindy jumped into her sloppy joy outfit and hurried off towards the theatre. But on the way, Cindy saw a dear old gentleman with a long white beard trying to cross the road. Because Cindy was a very kind girl, she thought, although I'm in a hurry, I must help this dear old gentleman. So she took his arm and helped him across the road. Ta very much, Wack, said the old gentleman. What a fab little girl. What a strange way for an old gentleman to talk, thought Cindy as she rushed on towards the theatre. But a terrible disappointment met Cindy. There was a big sign outside the doors which said, Sorry. All tickets sold for the Dolly Beats concert. To make it worse, lots of happy girls were running past waving their tickets for the concert. Cindy was heartbroken. Very, very slowly she walked back home, and although she tried very hard, she just couldn't help crying a little. Cindy suddenly realized that someone was talking to her. She looked up, and there was the old gentleman with the long white beard. What's the matter, love? Boo-hoo, <laughs> said Cindy. I'm too late to get a ticket for the Dolly Beats concert. <laughs> Don't be so sad, love, said the old gentleman. Here, who do I remind you of without this grotty false beard? Cindy stared in amazement as the old gentleman pulled off his beard. It was Cliff Warwick, the fabulous lead guitar player of the Dolly Beats. Dolly, wow, it's, it's Cliff Warwick. Cindy stumbled, it can't be. Oh, yes it is, said Cliff. I have to dress up like this or I can never get to the stage door past all those fans. Here, let's go. You can sit in the theatre while we do our rehearsal. marvellous time sitting all by herself in the front row of the theatre while the Dolly Beats rehearsed every one of their numbers. Dolly, wow, thought Cindy, this is the most exciting day of my life. But the most exciting part was yet to come. When the rehearsal seemed to be over, there was a roll of drums and Cliff Warwick walked to the front of the stage. Looking straight at Cindy, he said, You've been a wonderful audience, so wonderful that we'd like you to hear the first performance ever of our latest number. We've called it Cindy. Cindy was thrilled. Dolly, wow, she said. Imagine me having my very own song. And if you'd like to hear the song they wrote for Cindy, just play the other side of this record. the bell of every ball who is the prettiest girl of all who makes us feel ten feet tall it's cindy the doll we love the best cindy cindy she's a faithful she's fan a faithful hears us play whenever she, whenever can. she can who needs jane or mary and we got cindy the doll we love the best sweet cindy the name is cindy she's just the cutest doll you ever did see Sweet Cindy, yeah that's Cindy Everyone knows that she belongs to me She's the A-side, she's the top When she shakes, the whole place yeah, rocks We Cindy. all raise her top of the pops It's Cindy, the doll we love the best
Cindy, the name is Cindy. She took the cutest doll you ever did see. Sweet Cindy, yeah, that's Cindy. Everyone knows that she belongs to me. Who's the doll who knocks us out? Makes us yell. 